Welcome Pisces. I'm back y'all with another video. This is going to be for the month of October. So take what resonates and leave the rest, okay? So this is a general read. Whatever pops out, pops out. It's going to be for the month of October. Thank you, Spirit Ancestors. Give me a reading for Pisces. What's going on with Pisces for the month of October? What's going on with my Pisces for the month of October? All right, so at the bottom of the deck, we got the Seven of Pentacles, okay, and the Three of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles, the Hanged Man, and the Two of Pentacles. All right, so the first card that jumped out is the Five of Pentacles. So some of you guys could be feeling like left out or you're looking at your finances um, and maybe you feel like you aren't in the best financial situation. Um some of you just have maybe feeling like a lack of something. Okay, now we got the seven of pentacles here and the three of wands. It looks like you are very much so waiting for something to come in um, with the ace of pentacles here. It's like something could possibly be on hold. And it could definitely have something to do with something that you invested in. Um, something that you... Um, could be in regards to money as well it could be a business venture i'm getting like you, you feel like it's on hold but i still see you having a balance okay like you, you still feel like you've made um a solid choice okay tell me more give me more energy for pisces for the month of October. All right, so we have the page of pentacles. So maybe you have been communicating less with someone or you are rejecting calls, okay? Could be with a baby father. Maybe you feel like you're in uh, full control of a situation. You're feeling very independent. Um, like you can, you could get, you could do for yourself. Okay, some of you have walked away from a stressful situation. The situation was stressful. Um, and you, some of you have new love coming in, possibly with the fire sign, with this king of wands here, ace of cups. Yeah, two of cups. You guys got new love coming in. You guys got new love coming in. That was confirmation. Yes, you guys got a new romance. Ace of Cups and the Two of Cups. This new person that is coming in is very passionate. Like everything that you desire. You guys could be, this Five of Pentacles could be like y'all leaving somebody behind. You're ignoring calls, okay? You're leaving somebody out in the cold. You're rejecting someone. Eight of Swords, okay. Two of Wands and Temperance. Some of you guys are definitely dealing with Sagittarius. Yes, yeah, like it's like you're deciding to put something on hold or something is going on hold or someone is going on hold, okay? And you're okay with it. Like you feel balanced about it. Like you find peace in, in this decision, you found peace in this decision. Whatever this decision is, you found peace in it. There's a golden new opportunity, something that you've been waiting on that is manifesting. Okay. Seven of Pentacles here. Something is growing. Something is, you've been waiting for this opportunity and it's happening now. Okay. You're getting your justice in a situation. Somebody could have been being sneaky and manipulative towards you with the Seven of Swords and the Empress and the Ten of Pentacles here. There could have been other people. Uh, could This could be in regards to family as well. Somebody could have been definitely keeping secrets from you, possibly by the third party. Um, but they're going to end up regretting their decision, okay? Uh, something fell apart as well, too. I saw that as well. Tell me why the five of pentacles is here. 
just like you were stuck in some type of situation yes look justice you're getting ready to get justice it's something a situation has been drug out for too long it looks like you're getting ready to get your justice okay there's a new look at this ace of wands there's a fresh new beginning for you so october is bringing in um fresh new energy okay it looks like you guys got new love coming in could be a king of cups um feeling emotionally balanced as well as your pentacle it looks like you're manifesting abundance here with the magician and the queen of pentacles it looks really really good for you if i'm getting fresh new energy you knew your intuition was telling you it's time for you to take a break anyway from this devil okay this person is very toxic this situation was toxic everything about it just screamed no okay your intuition was telling you it was time anyway to take a break okay and give this energy give some give that energy back to you put that energy back to you okay a situation involving possibly a king of pentacles virgo taurus capricorn this situation was extremely burdensome okay maybe you were carrying off weight in this situation okay so now you're standing your ground okay and doing the work and making the changes the necessary changes now i do want to see why the eight of swords is here two of swords okay i feel like you were really stuck it was it's a situation that you were stuck in your head about it looks like you are getting justice okay you're getting justice karma is being served okay i feel like there's something in the past that was disappointing okay that left you feeling very disappointed okay definitely something from the past with the six of cups um queen of swords here i feel like you're being more logical i feel like this situation taught you a lot of lessons okay you're moving forward you're progressing you're moving forward i feel like some of you have cut this person or this situation could be a job could be anything i feel like you have cut this off and you are moving on okay you have you've completely cut someone out of your life a situation out of your life okay that's good that's good now we got the page of pentacles three of swords yeah you could be getting a message you could be getting some type of message of some sort okay about maybe you found out about a third party and this energy put you in this place okay heartbreak sorrow energy i feel like you are coming out of that okay i feel like there were plenty of lessons that you learned from the situation and you're taking those lessons with you okay ten of cups here queen of pentacles yeah see i feel like <laughs> your season of feeling left out or feeling rejected or feeling down on yourself has that cycle is closing okay i feel like you're focused on yourself you're focused on your well-being you're focused on your finances like you're emotionally happy as well as financially happy as well okay some of y'all definitely for sure for sure about to get a new man get a new woman there's a new beginning a new start here could be with a water sign Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Fire, Sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Doesn't have to be. It's just the energy here. Ten of Pentacles, okay? You're getting ready to have a long-term, stable connection here with someone. Whether it be a partnership, whether it be a love interest. I'm getting a love interest, okay? Maybe some of y'all are going to decide to keep this connection private with the Four of Pentacles and the world. A lot of you are going to be keeping this uh, this new love on the low. You know, you feel like it's not a need to put your business out because, you know, with the Six of Swords and Ten of Swords here, you were completely moving on from this, this burdensome situation. So, I mean, you're trying to protect this new connection by keeping it private. Because, baby, you're moving forward. And this time, you're moving forward with a strong mind. 
Okay, you're moving moving forward with a strong mind. The situation from the past was too disappointing. Okay, so it was time to get the hell out of Dodge. Okay, they may come around you with an offer, but I feel like the uh, that chapter has closed. Okay, that chapter has closed. You um have gained victory. You won. You came out on top. Okay, so let's look at the past here. We got the Page of Cups, okay. There could have been an apology. We got the Seven of Pentacles and the Four of Wands, Judgment, Five of Cups, the Magician, and the High Priestess. I really feel like you were being very patient with a connection. For some of you, it was a marriage here with the Four of Wands. Or someone that you were with for a long time. Or just a group of community of people. Could be a family. Family. Um, a judgment call was made here with judgment. A decision was made. Somebody's over here crying over spilled milk. But I feel like intuitively you felt like it was time to take a break. The situation was becoming too toxic. You were giving too much energy to this person, this situation. Okay, you were giving too much energy to it. Why is the Page of Cups here? Seven of Swords. They're telling you, like this person that you were dealing with came with a lot of lies, a lot of deception, and a lot of manipulation. We got the Queen of Cups, the Emperor here, Nine of Pentacles. You're back in control, okay? At that moment, in your recent past, you made the decision that you were back in control. You had walked away from this situation because it was giving you a headache. It was giving you, causing you a lot of stress. In that moment, in your recent past, you decided that was it. That's the future energy. Ace of Pentacles, you got a new beginning, a new opportunity. And when this opportunity, I tell you, this opportunity is going to be so grand, okay? This opportunity is going to bring you so much abundance with this Ace of Pentacles. This is a, a, a very good opportunity for some of you. It's a good job. Because see, look, you started off with the Five of Pentacles. That was the first card that jumped out today. Your future energy is the Ace of Pentacles. Okay, so you definitely are coming out of a situation that did not serve you anyway. Okay? You got you had to let that go. Ten of Swords, Six of Swords. You needed to let that go. Okay, Ace of Pentacles. Tell me more about the Ace of Pentacles here. The Eight of Pentacles. For some of you, there is a new job opportunity. Okay? Some of you are getting a new job, a new position. Some of y'all are getting raises. It's like your finances are going to be very, very good. Okay? For some of you, there's a pregnancy here. We got the Star and the Empress. Okay? This could be a, a pregnancy. Some of you could find out that you're pregnant. And some of you are just have grown into this it's just like so much growth, okay? You're realizing your worth. You realize that you're the star, okay? That you're the prize and you're moving forward. I swear like you 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 have you have grown so much. Whatever the situation was from the past, it taught you so many lessons. You're taking those lessons with you and you're moving forward. There's lots of confirmation here. Okay, now tell me more about this Eight of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. There's somebody new coming in for you. This person is going to put in the effort. This person is going to be doing the work. King of Pentacles. This person coming with the bag. This person coming with the bag. You hear me? All this energy is Pentacles. Okay? It's like you're being rewarded for standing up for yourself. You're being rewarded for... Um, not settling. We got the lovers. Could be done with the Gemini. Knight of Pentacles. It took a while for this offer. For this type of energy to come in. Because you needed to let go of these things. These are lessons that you had to learn. But baby that bag. That bag. The abundance. It's like you're being rewarded. For standing your ground. You've been rewarded. You passed the test. 
you've passed with flying colors because you're being rewarded. I told you, like currently you might feel like things are on hold, but baby, the growth, you about to realize that you the prize, baby. You got to realize it. You got to move like you the prize. You got to think like you the prize. You got to listen. This future energy, baby, is beautiful. Beautiful. You're going to have people spying on you. Could be an earth sign spying on you because you're getting all this attention. You winning, right? You winning. You won. They couldn't defeat you. Somebody tried to um, try to end you. Somebody tried to stop you. <sighs> Why the hangman here? Queen of Wands. Your confidence level. Look at this here. You go again, Queen of Cups. <laughs> There you go again, the emperor. There you go again, and nine of cup. I mean, nine of pinnacles. Your confidence level is shooting through the roof. King of Swords. You had to let some things go, baby. You will wait. Look at this. I, when I tell you, I can't make this stuff up. You cut, you had to cut somebody off to regain your confidence back. You're being rewarded for that. This person gets to watch you be a badass. And then on top of that, what you've been waiting for, a connection, a union that you've been waiting for, a new union that you've been waiting for, here he come. Here he come. Him, he or she. We got the seven of wands. Look at this. You standing your ground and standing up for yourself. Standing in your power. Then brought you in some love. True love. And it just took a while. It took a while. Because there is some things that you had to go through. Okay. There's some things. Look at this. The tower. There's some things that you had to go through. Okay. You're getting your confidence level back. You're getting all your everything that you desire. Okay. Look at this six of wands. Okay. You are victorious. Let's see how others view you. Ooh. Well, that fell on that fell on the floor, but it looked like it was the five of swords. Somebody feels like feels defeated. Because they couldn't uh knock you down and keep you down. Could be a Leo. We got the sun here. And they get to sit. I did not tell you. They gotta sit back and watch you be sit back and watch you win. They got to sit back and watch you win. The magician. They're going to be trying to manifest um, or copy and do similar things competing with you. Because they all over here confused on how you did it. On how you taking these leap, this leap of faith. How all of a sudden you got a new beginning. We got the six of swords. Yeah. This person over here is feeling like regretful, crying over spilled milk. Oh, you got some haters too. What's going on in your hopes and fears section? Six of Cups. You are free from your past. Look at this. The Fool and the Six of Cups. You are free. You've been set free from the Six of Cups energy. You've been set free from this past energy. I don't know what it was about this past energy, but it was not a good situation. You have been set free. You're free from your past. Oh, these cards just keep falling. Look at that, the star. 
Look at this. You don't really, you don't, <laughs> you have healed from your past. This is your hopes. You knew, you knew like it's, I'm, I'm healing from that. Okay. I'm done with that. Let's see what your outcome is. This is the most beautiful reading. What's the outcome? We got the Hierophant and the Eight of Wands. Could be done with the Taurus. Tell me more about this Hierophant energy. Queen of Cups. Okay. Then we got the Three of Cups, baby. Okay. So somebody definitely wants to collaborate with you. Could be a Leo with the Strength card here. Somebody wants to collaborate with you. But... You got to be careful because this could cause like somebody to feel like they got to compete with you and bring in a lot of confusion. But as far as some of y'all are possibly getting um, an engagement, getting engaged. Tell me more about the Hierophant and the Queen of Cups. The lovers, didn't I tell you, honey? Didn't I tell you? I'm telling you. Y'all got something big. Something big. It's like a, a shift. It was like possibly bad for a little while. You possibly couldn't see. And then my eyes jumping right now. You possibly couldn't see past what was right in front of you. But what is coming in, honey? You not about to be feeling like this no more. You not about to be feeling like this. You not This person that's coming in is not even going to give you no reason to feel like this. They come in with gifts and offers and kisses and hugs. Okay, this is what you've been waiting on. This is the type of connection that you've been waiting on. Four of Wands. For some of you, y'all could be getting engaged soon. Things could be going to the next level soon. Okay, because new, new energy is coming in. Okay, new energy is coming in. This is a, this reading is so beautiful. This reading is extremely beautiful. Okay, so if this message resonated with you guys, be sure to hit the thumbs up. Comment below and share with your family and your friends. If you're new, go ahead and click the bell to subscribe, all right? So until next time, ciao for now.